Welcome back to my next video on um, our microservice. And in this um, tutorial, we are going to build a transaction service. Okay, so I'm going to create a new folder that I'm going to call it transaction hyphen service. Okay, I'm going to create a new file, which I'm going to call it transaction. And um, in the same folder, I'm going to create a Docker file, which is going to be empty for now. The next one is going to be our requirements.txt file. Requirements.txt. Yeah, so that is all we need for now. So let's import um, some packages. Going to import JSON, import login. Going to say from Kafka, import. Kafka producer, um, I think as well as um, Kafka consumer. Okay. So we're going to also import the login dot basic config level is equal to login dot info. Okay. So now I'm just going to paste in some few um, variables, which I'm going to explain very soon. Okay. So what we're doing here is that we're creating um, the other topic, which is called other details just like before and we're creating another one called other processed kafka topic or other process and then also the bootstrap server which is this which we are still going to explain very soon and um we are going to create both a consumer and um a producer okay Okay, so this is the consumer and this is the producer. So we can comment it out, consumer and um, producer, okay. And um, if you look at the, the diagram, you see that we have transaction service that is consuming from other details topic and also producing to other process topic. So it's it's a consumer and a producer at the same time. Okay. So that's why we have a consumer in there and then a producer. So the consumer is consuming from other details and then the producer, you see that will be producing to other processed topic. Okay. So that is all we're doing here. Nothing complicated. So we're going to create our main. Um, so I'm going to log something, login.info. So we can say started processing transactions. Okay. So we're going to loop over the consumer, okay, and grab all the messages and process the message and then write it back to another topic called other processed topic. So we're going to say while true, um, we'll say for message and consumer, we want to say json dot loads loads we want to say the message 
dot the value we want to decode the message anytime you are reading or consuming from the consumer it's 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 bytes okay it's encoded so we need to decode these bytes back to a python object okay so we say decode those messages using the utf8 and um we'll assign this thing to a new variable called consume message okay that is all we're doing here so now we can use this we can extract whatever we want from this message so this is now a new message okay so we can extract a bunch of information from it so we want to extract the username so we're going to say consume message and um, we want since it's, it's a json or a dictionary we can use a square bracket to extract uh, the values using the keys so now we can pass in the username which is the key we can also extract the quantity from that message. And then we say quantity. We can also extract the price. So now we can now use the Um, the quantity and the price to calculate the total cost, okay, of the orders. Okay, so let's do that. So total cost is equal to Q T Y times price. Okay, so that's that's all we need here. Uh, maybe we can try try to round it to two decimal places. Round to um, it's gonna be like a float. Once a float, then we can round it to two decimal places. Yeah, so that is all we need. So now we're going to create another object uh, dictionary, which is going to take username is equal to username. And um, we can pass in the order ID which is coming from the consume message or the underscore ID. And um, we can also pass the email uh, consume message. And we pass in the email. And um, the total cost okay so that is all we need we need here and um, the next thing we need to do is we want to log some info okay so we're just going to pass success successful transaction transaction sent okay and then we're going to pass in the data that we are sending and um the last thing we want to do is to send message to processed on that topic. So we just call the producer 
dot send and then we pass in the order process topic okay and then now we can call the json on dump and then code it dumps and we we say dot encode to utf8 okay so that is all for our transaction service okay um if we have any issues um we'll fix it later on but basically that is it so this transaction we are just processing all the messages that are coming into our other topic other details topic and then we're picking up the quantity and the price out of that message calculate the total cost and then pushing that um, to a new topic or other processed okay topic that is all we're doing with this microservice okay so um with the docker file we are going to use the same format um so i'm going to paste that in and change this to transact transaction.py okay um yeah so basically that is it transaction.py and then we're going to pass in our kafka hyphen python and then the faker yeah let's put the faker there we don't need it but let's just maintain it so that is all for the transaction service um nothing complex here at the moment um yeah so basically that is it for this service um thanks for watching um i'll see you in the next um service